Okay. I have the honor and privilege, guys, to introduce Mr. Carl Kent the third. Okay, and he's gonna to talk today about the strangest places on earth. Don't be surprised that if, if my house is not on this list. <laughs> Carl. Okay. My name is Carl Martin Kent the third. Named after my dad, Carl Martin Kent II, and he was named after his dad, my grandpa, Carl Martin Kent I. I have a son, Carl Martin Kent IV. We can't think of any new names, but yes, it was Donald. Lovely. Father? Father? You can't hear me now? Now you can hear me. Okay, I wasn't wanting to deafen anybody, but. Uh, Okay, so my name is Carl Martin Kin III. I was named after my father, Carl Martin Kin II. He was named after my grandpa, Carl Martin Kin I, and um, I have a son, Carl Martin Kin IV. And that's because we can't think of any names, we just use numbers. You know, In any case, um, I wanted to uh, call attention to the lemon that I brought with me and it's a very serious warning that I want to give you all. If you have any cats in your apartment and you have lemons laying around and the cat eats the lemon, it will become a sour puss. <laughs> now I know you're listening. So why in the world would anyone make a presentation about the strangest places on earth? Why would they do that? Well, I started to wonder myself why I'm doing this. And then I realized when I Googled strangest places on earth, there are many, many places I've never been on earth before that I, most of them, I don't want to go to. And I thought, well, it would make an interesting presentation uh, to show the places on the earth that you might want to go to, or you might not want to go to. And so that's what the presentation is about, uh, the strangest places on earth. Now, to help us, I, I brought Felix the cat. That's him right here. And when we go from one slide to another, Felix, will move to a certain place in the picture to draw your attention to something or other. At least something he thinks is good to look at. I don't know if I always agree with him, but he uh, does that. And I have kept the lemon away from him so he isn't going to act up in the presentation. I don't think so, anyway. So the strangest places on earth. Old Faithful may be more famous, but the Grand Prismatic Hot Spring is the most photographed thermal uh, feature in Yellowstone, and that's because of its crazy bright colors and enormous size. So, deeper than a 10-story building, extremely hot travels uh, 121 feet from a crack in the earth to reach the surface of the spring. Football field on steroids. It's that big. Rainbows of color. The hot spring has bright bands of orange, yellow, and green ring. The deep blue waters in the spring. The multicolored layers get their hues from different species of thermophile heat-loving bacteria living in the progressively cooler water around the spring. And the deep blue center, that's because water scatters the blue wavelengths of light more than any other. Uh, now, a living thermometer. What living thing in Yellowstone has helped investigators solve crimes and NASA search for extraterrestrial life on seemingly inhospitable hospitable planets, the heat-loving microbes living in Yellowstone thermal pools. And there's a close-up of the spring there. 
And then uh, here we are uh, in winter and spring, the lake located northwest of Aceoyus in British Columbia's Okanagan Valley looks just like any other body of water. But as most of the water starts to evaporate in summer, hundreds of huge briny pools are left behind, leaving a polka dotted landscape of yellow, green, and blue spots. The CBC calls the, calls the appropriately named Spotted Lake the most magical place in Canada. In Paris, catacombs are a network of old quarry funnel, uh, tunnels uh, beneath Paris that serve as the ultimate resting place for about six million Parisians. The majority of the skulls and bones were collected from the city's overcrowded cemeteries in the 18th and 19th centuries. The bones uh, were not arranged in the horrific displays um, seen today until the government realized its potential as a tourist attraction. A massive volcanic eruption blasted forth a mass of molten basalt, which consolidated and contracted as it cooled, forming the fractures that can still be seen today. This World Heritage Site is home to an estimated 37,000 polygon columns, which are so geometrically perfect that local mythology claims they were built by a giant. It is a strong contender for one of the world's strangest locations. These towering limestone pinnacles, located in Hunan province, China, are surrounded by lush foliage and frequently shrouded in a mist. A cable car connects human village to Tanzian, meaning son of heaven village. And from there, there are numerous routes to enjoy the spectacular view of Tianzi. They are unsurprisingly the model for the floating mountains in the film uh, Avatar. The world's largest salt pan, as well as one of the strangest locations on the planet, is located in the Potos and Oranu departments. It is also the world's largest um, natural mirror uh, when a thin layer of water forms on the surface. Uh, Solaire de Uni is the dried up remains of, of a lake leaving behind a void of bright white salt granite formations and khaki islands. In stormy weather, the surf rushes into the gaping pit at Thor's Well in Oregon, also known as Spouting Horn, and then shoots upwards with enormous power. Take the Captain Hook Trail from the Cape Perpetua Scenic Area Visitor Center to see it, but keep well back for your own safety, especially at high tide or during winter storms. Hamuka Cotton Palace is a spectacular UNESCO World Heritage Site in southwest Turkey that also includes the ancient ruins of the Hapolis, the once great city that was built around it. Water pours down the white uh, travertine terraces from natural springs, forming lovely thermal pools, ideal for a brief dip. The Rishak structure, also known as Gula at Rishak, is a remarkable circular geological formation in the Andar Plateau of the Sahara, near Quatrain, northwest Africa. 
Rakat means feather in the local dialect, and it is also known as Tagazine in Arabic. This is one of the weirdest places in the world, and you might want to go see it for yourself, but be careful. Because of the presence of specific plankton and minerals, the lake has a peculiar pink color. It is 30 kilometers drive north of Dakar. The presence of Donaeli salina algae in the water uh, is what causes the water to be pink. It is notable for having a high salt content, up to 40% in some places. The wave is a sandstone um, rock formation close to Arizona's uh, northern border with Utah. It is a real world of psychedelic patterns and whirling hues. There is no signage for hikers in order to protect the natural beauty and integrity of this natural place. You'll have to figure out how to get in and how to get out of this place. <coughs> The many tints of blue and the ice crystals within these tunnels is a natural phenomena that has perplexed scientists for many, many years. This is up in the Arctic region. Caves are usually uh, bounded by asymmetrical rocks naturally formed over many centuries. Uh, take a peek at these square caves in Scotland that are asymmetrical, I th I'm sorry, that are symmetrical. These caverns are located in Staffa's uninhabited islands. People rarely enter these caves with the exception of researchers and scientists. However, if you are interested, you can visit these caves and take a peek at this nature's anomaly. Myanmar may not be the most well-known location. This is why Myanmar is home to Nayuat Ohak, which is a sign to behold in and of itself. It is difficult to find a strange forest community with over 1,000 ruined temples anywhere else. This location is lush with vegetation and is quite a sight to see. A bunch of ruined temples. These are not your typical swimming pools. They are essentially acid pools. Even what appears to be land is made up of brittle salt and sulfuric crust. This is one of the oddest places on the planet. The tectonic plates beneath the Dakanai Depression are still moving. Scientists predict that unless the movement stops, the land will continue to sink below sea level. Stacks of pancake-like rocks were formed by thousands of layers of sandstone and limestone that collected on the ocean floor. A series of walkways flowing through the rock formation lead to the pancake rocks, some of which are wheelchair accessible and others carved into stairways up and down the rock sides. On your trip to New Zealand, make sure you stop by this location. The Manapuni rock formation are a group of seven stone pillars found west of the Ural Mountains in the Komi Republic of Tranasak, a Korshi district. They are situated on the mountain Manpur Dior between uh, the Lynch and Pechora rivers on the Pechora Ilishi reserved lands. Megalith stone jars shrouded in legend are found in clusters of one um, to 100 around the Exan Kuang province. 
enormous cylinder jars may have been used in ancient death rituals. According to one notion, northern Laos was bombed heavily by the United States in the 60s, and some regions have just lately been cleansed and designated safe for travel. This strange work of art growing out of the sand in the center of Chile's Atacama Desert, 46 miles from Antofagasta, is the creation of Chilean sculptor Mario Trezapo. Trezapo is recognized for his works that depict human pain, and his massive, unsettling sculpture evokes a sense of loneliness, which is heightened by its desolate, and isolated setting. These colossal lines, seared into the desert landscape of southern Peru, are one of the world's most bizarre destinations. These only make sense from the skies where people can see the unusual forms etched into the normally desolate desert landscape, as illustrated in the film Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. <laughs> On lonely Yurchkan Island, 82 kilometers off the coast of Alaska, a stretch of the northern shore has become a macabre trust attraction. Massive whale jaw bones, ribs, and vertebrae form an, a, an eerie passageway in the ground. The site is thought to be from the 14th or 15th century, although no one knows whether it was a sacred gathering place for aboriginal tribes or merely a gathering place for the mass killing. The D. Brook Bridge is another unique location that belongs in the category of strange places in the world. Built in the 15th century, the bridge and its mirror merge into a complete and perfect stone circle, no matter which way you look at it. The bridge, however, has little utility as there is no way for people to mount on it anymore. The 1,700 odd conical hills of Sohat, Philippines, dot the center of the island. They vary in height, but their shape is so consistent that they may be mistaken for man-made. They are, however, the uh, elevation of coral deposits, according to UNESCO. Only during the dry season, when the foliage turns from rich green to brown, do the hills earn their moniker of chocolate. On the largest of the islands in Western Australia's Recorrect Acapello, this unique lake was found in 1802. The lake's deep pink color is maintained all year, according to some experts, due to high salinity paired with the presence of salt-loving algae called a dunalalia, a salina and pink bacteria called halobacteria. These stunning uh, travertine terraces in northern Iran are natural wonder. Travertine is generated by calcium deposits uh, flowing in water. And in this case, the calcium deposits are from two distinct hot springs with very mineral comp compositions. The terrace's unique reddish color is due to a significant concentration of iron oxide in one of the springs. The 
this is an MBR. Uh, dead by translates to dead marsh, and the area is also known as Dewey V. It is sun blackened dead forest and white clay pit, resembling dried oases. The lack of water causes the tree roots to come outside in search of moisture, making it one of the strangest places on the planet. This location has been used for filming feature films before. This lonely island, which was separated from mainland Africa, seems like something out of science fiction movies. Because of Sokoraki's extraordinary and unique biodiversity, there are plants and trees found nowhere else on the planet, like the old and twisted dragon blood tree you see here, and the bulbous bottle tree, which are particularly strange. This unearthly geyser can be found on private land on the outskirts of Nevada's the Black Rock Desert. A scorching fountain erupts up to five feet high today after an energy firm bore down into geothermal waters back in 1964. And the consequent mineral buildup means the cone is increasing by several inches each year. Although there is only a tea house at the end of the dangerous death-defying trail in China, the Mount Huashan Plank Walk in the sky is famous for its adrenaline pumping effects. The road to heaven is what it is called because of the near deadly consequences you face if you happen to meet an accident. It's a long walk and a dangerous walk to a tea shop. Christ of the Abyss is a, a 2.50 meter tall bronze statue of Jesus Christ. Deep sea divers favor this spot and undoubtedly one of the strangest underwater locations on the planet. Guido Galletti, a, a submerged bronze statue of Jesus Christ, is one of the top tourist attractions in Italy uh, for thrill lovers. This beach is covered in a special seaweed called suida, which turns a vivid red color in the autumn. These tidal wetlands located 30 kilometers southwest of Panjin are an important wildlife reserve for migrating birds. Only a small area of the beach is exposed to the public, but a wooden path that goes out to, to the sea can be explored. A remarkable UNESCO World Heritage Site in Southwest Turkey, a visit to Pam Kukayel Cotton Palace, also takes in the ancient ruins of Hierapolis, the once great city that was built around it. Water cascades from natural springs down the white travertine terraces and forms stunning thermal pools, perfect for a quick dip. <coughs> this green leafy tunnel part of an industrial railway in Ukraine looks like something out of a fairy tale. It is well known for being a popular spot for couples to promenade in the morning or evening. If you want to surprise your significant other on Valentine's Day, schedule a vacation to the Tunnel of Love instead of going to Disneyland. This gleaming sea glass beach in California is an amazing result of years of trash deposited on the beach. This was not stopped until the 1960s, by which time the sea had been clogged with everything from electrical gadgets to bottles and cans. 
the waves eventually shattered everything into colorful pebbles, and the beach became a popular tourist destination. A bunch of junk turned by the sea into colorful pebbles. In the, this region of Pago, there are 70 marine lakes. This lake is distinct from the others because it contains jellyfish. Jellyfish Lake was closed to the public in 2012 due to a decline in the number of jellyfish in the lake. However, the jellyfish population has bounced back and now Jellyfish Lake is one of the strangest places on earth. This Colombian river glows red throughout the hot months. The riverbed is covered by a peculiar variety of plants that turns red, making it one of the strangest places on our planet. The river of five colors, or the liquid rainbow, are two names for the river also. It has been dubbed the most beautiful body of water on the planet. As it flows, it changes its color. Near the southwestern edge of the Catlins and Toto's Bay, a slope point, the southernmost point of the South Island, is another of the world's weirdest places. Because of the strong Antarctic winds, the trees in this woodland are permanently bent and wind-blown. This is one of the world's windiest and oddest locations. The steep cliffs um, eroded by powerful winds and time and to the beauty of the add to the beauty of this scene. Painted Hills is one of the strangest places on our planet. Make plans to visit Oregon as soon as possible to explore this fascinating place. Minerals stain the slopes at John Day of fossil beds, painted hills in a variety of colors. Yellow, reds, golds, and blacks are affected by alternating light and moisture levels. Lengues Mara National Park is a protected area in Brazil and one of the most mysterious places on Earth. There is a reason why this location is considered unique in the, in the country. Although it appears to be a desert, this Brazilian national park features numerous tiny lakes separated by sand dune-like structures. The contrasting colors of the area make it a great fit for your Instagram photos. The Nika Mines Giant Crystal Cave is also one of the strangest places on the planet. These massive gleaming mineral pillars deep within the Earth's uh, innards are enough to make you feel claustrophobic. This massive structure has been built beneath Mexico. It is a fascinating case study of how creatures cope with high heat and humidity. There are only 100 humans on this island, but there are thousands and thousands and thousands of cats. The inhabitants, on the other hand, are ecstatic about their living situation. Cat Island is located in the Ehim Prefecture of Japan, which is a remote part of the country. The cats surpass the human, human population by a factor of 10 to 1. Cats were introduced to fishing boats to kill rats, but they stayed on the island. I hope they don't have any lemons there. <laughs> there are innumerable carved effigies of huge heads sprawled across the beach. 
made by the Rapa Nui civilization back in the first millennium CE when this place was not even uh, called Easter Island. They were fashioned right out of the black rocks on the island, chiseled and chipped in perfection by the Paro Nui people using primitive tools. Eerie and battered toys hang from the trees on the desolate Mexican island of Axel Pico. The scene seems like something out of horror films, with dolls dangling in the middle of nowhere. Legend has it that these dolls began washing up on the sand after a girl drowned in one of the nearby canals. After that, one of the town's single residents hung them from the trees for unknown reasons. And there are thousands of these dolls hanging from the trees. One of the top weirdest places across the world is located in the Tosi and Oro departments. This is the world's largest salt pan and one of the strange places in the world. And when a thin film of water gathers on the surface, it also um, the world's largest natural mirror. Again, the best sight of this space can be observed from the central Equus Islands. Looking for some weird place in the world? How about this terrifying lake? Animals that die in this African lake are turned into statues through calcification. The, present, the presence of huge volumes of sodium bicarbonate ensures they turn into mummies. And because of the high alkaline collection, uh, the lake looks red in color, especially uh, during summer in Tanzania. This is the reason why this lake is also known as the petrifying lake. In spite of all these conditions, it is a grazing ground for the lesser flamingos and fancy dips. Uh, but don't think of taking a dip in this lake. Underwater park, fun below the water. This list wouldn't be complete without some underwater beauties. One of the most weird places of the world, located in Green Lake in uh, Tragos, this is not just a gimmick but a genuine park that goes underwater during the spring. After all, the scuba divers all need to rest and relax. It is considered as one of the most fabulous waters to dive in around Europe due to the rarest natural phenomena in the most beautiful lakes in Austria. Have you uh, booked your tickets yet? It says here, I don't think so. Underwater park. Uh, the Eternal Flame um, uh, Falls is one of the most craziest places in the world. However, it is a, a, a quaint waterfall located in Shale Creek Preserve, which is a section of Chestnut Ridge Park in western New York. A small item in the waterfall's base emits natural gas. Interestingly, it can be um, lit to produce a flame. This flame is visible all year round. It can be extinguished and most occasionally will be relit. The flame is fueled by that natural gas and burns bright, right under the waterfalls. The Schiffer Rift experienced two continents underwater. The Schiffer Rift, one of the most obscure places in the world, separates two continents and two tectonic plates, namely the North American and the Eurasian plates. It occupies an area of about 600 to 200 meters. Uh, it, it is touted to be one of the most unique phenomena on Earth. Two continents about to bump into each other. Blood Falls witness the red water flow. Amidst the unending whiteness of the snow, Blood Falls provides a creepy relief. The water is red in color due to the presence of huge amounts of iron. Definitely makes the list of the strangest places in the world. Con 
confluence of Rhone and the Arve rivers see them merging. Well, there is a, a, a defined contrast between these two rivers of Switzerland. One is blue and the other brown. They never fully mix due to the difference in density, and they mix in Geneva, which is situated in Switzerland. It is hard to walk by this beautiful marvel of nature and not feel overwhelmed by whatever nature has to offer us. Go ahead and Google and search for this if you want to see that these rivers parallel do not merge their colors. The river remains noticeably separate. To understand why this happens, you need to follow each river back to its source. The Rhone River originates from the sources in the Swiss Alps, and it's filtered as it flows along the route to give crystal clear turquoise waters. Our river, on the other hand, is fed by melting glaciers of the Mont Blanc Massif, and carries a distinctive milky gray color because of the fine sediment it carries from the mountains. Both rivers therefore flow at different speeds because of their different origins and contain vastly different quantities of minerals, which alters their density. When the waters of the two rivers meet, it's so different that instead of mixing, it separates. And for a time, it looks like there are two distinct rivers sharing the same course. <laughs> sea of stars walk down in glowing water. Bioluminescent uh, sea plankton that shines bright blue during the night makes the sea area at uh, Badu Island look like the sea of stars. The sea of stars at Badu Island um, May dives attracts millions of tourists every year. The tourist footfall seems to be only increasing after uh, they see the seek was featured in far, um, far and few Hollywood and Hollywood films. The Melrose is listed as one of the cheapest destinations in the world, and this beach is one of the weirdest places that glows in the dark. Nelson Lakes National Park witnessed its beauty. Do you get extremely excited about jungle safaris and walking tours of the national parks in general? Well, this one might just surprise you with its um, uh, uniqueness. There is uh, an interesting blue lake at uh, the Nelson Lakes National Park, one of the weirdest uh, places across the world. But what's so weird about it? How about the fact that this lake is so clear that you can see it all the way to the bottom? Uh, came across any oddity shaped trees lately? Well, how about these here near the uh, Grillo West Pomeranium? Welcome to the most bizarre place on earth. Very few people visit the region, so why, uh, why don't you try it out? Uh, and you will see these curved trees for which there is no scientific explanation. A great blue hole, take a dive in a sinkhole, a gigantic natural submarine sinkhole. No one knows the depth of the sinkhole. The blue hole is a popular spot for free diving. You will be amazed at the power this sinkhole exudes. It is also touted to be the most dangerous and deadly spot in the world by experts. We suggest that you exercise caution in this area. Dead sea, float over the water. Can't swim? No problem. The Dead Sea, a salt lake, will ensure, ensure you can float without any effort. Due to the high volume of salt and other minerals in the water, the Dead Sea is uh, 10 times as salty as the ocean, with a salinity of about 34%. Just a disclaimer, if you open your eyes while in its water, it will sting quite a bit. Lake Redbuck witnessed the pink water body Another pink lake. The wave, just a, out of a painting. The wave is sandstone rock formation located near the border of Arizona with Utah. 
It's a dreamlike world of swirling colors and psychedelic patterns. Mount uh, Kelly witness of three different color lakes there. Uh, El Laswa rock formation, bewildering natural phenomena. There are many natural occurrences that can bewilder us. This is one of them. This little slice of perfection. See the uniform slit between the flat surfaces? No human did that. No one knows how it happened. Different shades of blue in the ice crystals inside these caves is a natural phenomenon that has left scientists baffled for years in Alaska. As a rule, caves are round in shape with round rocks, but not this one. Take a look at these symmetrical square caves. Once again, uh, we saw those in Scotland. Here's some more that we can see uh, also in South America, Scotland as well. A 145 foot high um, underground waterfall that is illuminated to create this lovely purplish hue. Near Tennessee. The remarkable beach that boasts of pitch black sand due to volcanic activity in the past. Hawaii. The marble cavern of Carey Lake. Amazing smooth and cool caves of marble. Water is clear enough to see deep down to the bottom. Your point is Paris. One of the wildest uh, and widest waterfalls in the entire world, Iguzo Falls, will give Niagara Falls a run for its money. Divides the river up, uh, upper and lower, Iguzo. The power of the falls was not was not utilized until the construction of the uh, Itapura Dam. The doorway railway of uh, Hanoi is a railway line that passes inches away, inches away from the doorsteps of shops through the residential neighborhood and commercial area of Hanoi. There's a, a street in Hanoi Vietnam, where a speeding train passes straight through twice a day. If you're in the way of the train, you are supposed to press tight into the adjoining wall or duck into a nearby cave, a cafe, uh, to escape being killed. You can feel the icon um, re resonate against your skin. It sounds terrifying. Unusually, uh, un unusual giant boulders um, dot the um, eroded Ataga coastline along the stretch of the Konin Beach. And, uh, and these stone scientists are not able uh, to explain how they were formed. This is a single rock, one single gigantic rock, which is a mountain itself with a height of 348 meters and a circumference of 5.8 miles. This is the world's largest rock and one of the weirdest places on Earth. While the rock surrounded, eroded, it stood its ground to become the longest surviving monolithic rock structure. This, uh, if this rock doesn't inspire you to keep um, hu hustling in life and staying true to all the promises you made yourself, we don't know what will in Australia. World's largest rock. An enormous, surreal flat top mountain said to be one of the most mysterious within an abundance of unusual plants and animals. Welcome to another weird place on the earth. This is the highest mountain in the Pacarama chain. It is furthermore the highest point in Venezuela. 
the mountain's highest point is named Labyrinthos del Norte, a higher a tour guide and trek up there if you want to. Flat top mountain. These are not your average um, run-of-the-mill uh, pools. These are actually acid pools. Uh, again, we've seen some of these elsewhere, and these uh, scientists believe um, that these acid pools will drop below the earth as well as they eat their way down. Small pools that we've seen before in Italy. Red Beach, you've seen this one before, just a different view of it. And uh, Cat, uh, Cat Island, this is another picture of it. And then Deep Death Valley in California is one of the weirdest places in the world, owing to the phenomena of the saline stones that have bewildered people for generations. In 1915, people had discovered a track here which indicated that a particular stone had moved from its place in the dry land. This saline stone had immediately been recorded, and the locals began further study so that they could learn more about its mystery, a stone that moves and leaves a trail. Magnetic Hill in Lakadak, India, India, is known to be one of the most unique places in the world where you can experience a truly unusual phenomenon. When you travel into the land of Lakadak, you will come across this place which tends to pull vehicles. This is essentially a tiny stretch of road on a hill that lies on the Sengarola Lake Highway. The mystery is that you can uh, pack your vehicle here and turn off the ignition of your car and your vehicle will slowly start moving on its own. A magnetic hill. Another one of our uh, list of most unusual places is the Stone Forest, in the, uh, which draws most of the same on the grounds of how strange um, it is. Unlike the green and wildlife nurturing forest in the world, um, what, what we have here are um, rocks that look like trees. Made by the Rapa Nui civilization back in the first millennium. And now we have Rabbit Island. Um, it all started in 1971 when an elementary school released just eight rabbits on Okanosha uh, Island off Japan. Rabbits did what they do, and the rest is history. That means that they're not technically wild rabbits, but they certainly are a huge colony of feral rabbits. Um, so for 40 years, the island has stood there, and uh, there were 700 rabbits in 2013, and now nobody knows how many there are. But they're all friendly. The Dubal Mall. The, this mall is known as the largest in the world because of its total area. It's about thir um, 13 million square feet and about 1,200 um, retail shops are there. There's an ice rink as well inside of it. Greenland. The largest island in the world is Greenland, which is also the least densely populated country in the world. Most of the country is covered in ice, and, it, and it, it's got its name from um, earlier Scandinavian settlers. And they like the color of their houses. The sequoia tree. Not only are sequoias the largest tree, but they're also the biggest things to live on this planet. The biggest things that live on this planet. On average, they grow to be anywhere from 160 to 270 feet tall, 75 feet tall, 20 to 26 feet in diameter. The strangest shoe stores in the world. In Venezuela, 
and years ago in Alton, Illinois. Ever wonder who holds the record for the world's largest feet and what size shoes that person sports? As it turns out, Guinness World Records keeps track of this for us. A man with the Guinness World Record feet today um, has got 22-year-old uh, Orlando Rodriguez, Hernandez of Venezuela. Hernandez, an avid basketball player, says he's had trouble finding shoes that fit since childhood. So he goes to this uh, shoe store. His foot measurement um, is 1.33 in inches uh, and um, 1.32 of oh, oh, different sizes. He puts them, he puts them in a whopping US size 26 shoe. And then the largest feet ever that ever existed, uh, while Hernandez holds a record for largest feet among the living, um, <coughs> The best, the biggest feet that ever have walked on the earth uh, that we know about, Robert Wadlow of Alton, uh, Illinois. He's standing here next to his father, and um, you can see his shoes there. He was eight foot, 11 inches tall. Goliath was um, about seven inches taller than Robert. And there are the shoe differences there. Starlings make any place on earth the strangest place when they murmurate, murmurate. I saw some murmuration on the way over to uh, Edwardsville yesterday, and uh, I just couldn't believe it made that place one of the strangest places on the earth. So flocks form a tight, spirit-like formation in flight, frequently expanding and contracting and changing shape. Seemingly without any sort of leader, each common starling changes its course and speed as a result of the movement of its closest neighbor. Mason Point. 
why has it become one of the strangest places on the planet Earth? It just became that place. And what I'm trying to do is encourage you to know that what makes a, a place strange sometimes are what the people who live there know. It is filled with those who, know, who now know about the strangest places of the earth. And that's how you became the strangest place. Do you have any questions? I always say this, um, I, uh, I don't care what question you ask me, I will know uh, the answer to it, or I will give you an answer to it. And, uh, if I make up the answer at the end of the made up answer, I will let you know I made it up. <laughs> Any questions? I thank you all for coming today and uh, hope to see you again in, in a few more weeks. I'm coming back with another presentation. So. Thank you, Paul.